guys welcome back to no catchy name it's me ella today is thursday june the 9th and this is stitch your library insert number because i don't remember i'm sitting here in the floor with june she's rolling around so i'm gonna have to reach over and unroll her put her back on her back so she doesn't whine she can roll both ways but she doesn't seem to like rolling off of her <laughs> stomach i usually have to help her because uh, she'll just sit there and whine anyways crochet this hamburger has taken me a month to complete. Just under a month. Just over a month. I started it on May 6th. And I finished it on May, or uh, June. Yeah. June, um, 7th. Do you need some help? Run over. Run over. Want the book? So, uh, it took me forever because of June. <laughs> She is a handful, ain't ya? Ain't ya? Are you hot? <laughs> She's looking at me like, what? So I got this book gifted to me, I think sometime last year. I can't remember exactly when uh, I got it. But it was on my Amazon wish list, and Deanna bought it for me and sent it to me. And it is the Iconic Women, Crochet Iconic Women. And it is by Carla Matrini, Matrani? I'm not sure how to say that. And she does have an Etsy shop that has other patterns than these ones. And she's also got some male patterns, which is pretty cool. I wish she had a book of male patterns because I have a son. So I would like to have iconic men too, you know, to make for him. And there's a bunch of these that I want to make. I probably won't make all of them. <laughs> but I know for sure the next one is going to be Marie Curie. <laughs> I'm definitely going to make her because she's one of my favorite iconic women. So she's going to be my second one to make. Yeah, I may not give her to you. I may not give this first one to you either. All right, so any guesses on who I made? Someone guessed in a comment and got it right. So who do you think I made? Real quick. And it's obviously not her because I just said I was going to make her next. <laughs> any guesses? Any guesses? Okay. I made it in pink because I love pink. Yeah. And I made da -da -da, Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. <laughs> I love anything to do with her and her family and the history of her family. Uh, I've watched so many documentaries, pretty much every documentary that I know of <laughs> about her and her, her lineage and uh, Diana and all that, of course. So oh, she, She's so cute. I love, love her. Oh, did you roll over again? I don't know what I did with your pacifier. Oh, there it is. Come on, let's roll back over. Roll over, roll over, roll over. Do you want your owl? Oh! Oh, Jamie. You want your owl? Ooh, 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 ooh. Got it? So I just love her. She's so cute. I used a... <laughs> I used a D hook. I'm pretty sure it was three millimeter and I think that's a D. Okay. <laughs> I keep getting distracted by June. I'm sorry. But I'm pretty sure I used a D hook, which is a three millimeter. I think that's a D. Because E is a 3.5. I'm pretty sure. I can't remember. <laughs> but um, this the smallest hook I've ever used. And it actually kind of hurt my hand at first. But then I got used to it. This is all worsted weight yarn. The skin tone is... I love this yarn. Light peach. Uh, the rest of it is red heart. Except the gray. I'm not sure what it is. It was just a scrap ball. It's just like a gray. kind of looks like it has brown undertones. But the pink is... I think it's petal pink or perfect pink. I always get those two mixed up. From... Um, Red Heart. <laughs> and then the black is all Red Heart Black. And she, you can't see it, but she has white underwear. <laughs> um, and it's Red Heart White. This is Red Heart White. And this pink right here is uh, Premier Just Yarn. I think it's called Dusty Rose or something like that. I just, I wanted a slightly different pink. So it, I could still be pink, but contrast with the hat pink. <laughs> but um, I love pink, obviously. I just said pink like a thousand times. <laughs> but um, so I looked up, I just typed in Queen Elizabeth II pink uh, outfit and I found, she, there was two that I found. One was a pale pink like this and one was like a hot pink, um, like a fuchsia e pink. And I picked the pale one. I just thought that was cute. And she's got her little handbag that she always has, which according to her Jubilee, if you can see it, there you go, <laughs> she keeps a sandwich in there. <laughs> If anybody watched that, um, yeah, which I thought was so cute, but um, I didn't make her with the intentions of it coming out around the time of her jubilee because honestly, I wasn't thinking about that in May when I first started this. 
um, I just love the queen. <laughs> so I wanted to make her, I've been wanting to make her forever. I think Valerie from Val Valerie's Cuddly Cat Crochet and Sewing, I think she made two of them. I believe she made a yellow one and maybe a blue one. I can't remember. But um, I just always wanted to make her and I knew that was the first one I was going to make from that book. So she's so cute. She took forever. But only because of somebody. Somebody needed all my attention. Yeah. You stinker. <laughs> but I got her done and she is mine. I might give her to her when she's older, but right now she's mine because she was a lot of work. I want to keep her pretty. Oh, I can't remember if I said her eyes are 20 millimeter safety eyes. I think. Now, maybe they're 12. Because I feel like 20 millimeter would be big. They're 12. I bet they're 12. I don't know. <laughs> I can't remember. But anyways, they're cute. I'll link this book down below if you want to check it out. I got it from Amazon, my wish list. So I know you can get it on Amazon. I'm sure you can get it by looking up this person's name. Um, and I'll also link her Etsy shop below because like I said, she's got other patterns on there. I know she's got like um, Marie Antoinette on there. She's got the Statue of Liberty, which I want. Um, she got a girl astronaut. Who else? She has some male characters. She has like Mozart and Picasso, uh, Charlie Chaplin, a few other male ones. I'm trying to think of who else she has. Uh, there's some of them that I have favorited that I want to get. I know I want Statue of Liberty, but I can't remember now. <laughs> I'm, I'm spacing. But I'll link them all down below if you want to check them out. Are you rolling over again? You're going to make yourself mad. You want one of your books? We got all her little books out that was gifted to her. And uh, she's been playing with them. They got squeakers in them. Are you eating it? You're not supposed to eat books. But you can, because you're just a baby. <laughs> I got all her toys laid out on the floor, because they told us to lay all her toys around her, so that she has something to, like, reach for. <laughs> um, to help her with her neck stiffness, because she hasn't been, like, lifting her arms up. Because she has a real stiff neck, which is weird. I don't know why she does that. <laughs> but, um, we're still on a waiting list for the physical therapy for her neck. They said that they're like two or three months behind, so it's, it may be forever before she gets to go to that. And by the time that we get to go to it, she might have already worked it out herself. But anyways, she's doing better. She hasn't been screaming as much like she's in pain. Back to the queen. <laughs> I'll link the pattern book down below, and I will link the Etsy shop down below if you want to check them out. And yeah, I guess that's it. I'll link below. <laughs> but I just think she's so cute. I'm gonna, I gotta find somewhere to put her where the kids can't get her. Cause they'll, they'll sling her around. Oh, are you mad? You need help? Let me flip you over. Let me flip you over. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and hop off here and deal with her cause I just took her onesie off of her because she's acting like she's hot. So now she's naked. <laughs> so I'm gonna hop off here and I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow cause I want to do that never have ever tag. And uh, there was something else that I wanted to do. I can't remember what it was. Oh well, I guess you'll see me if you see me. <laughs> and uh, I got a few collaborations coming up. Oh, come here. I got a few collaborations coming up. One of them is, um, turn around here. <laughs> One of them is with Kim the Crafty Nomad. I'm doing her summer hop. I'm gonna try to. <laughs> and also, um, I was asked to make someone's pattern and like showcase it. And I'll be doing that one. And then uh, that's gonna involve a giveaway too. So look for that one. And uh, yeah, I don't know what else I'll be getting into, but she's a little cranky. She's probably hungry. So I'm gonna hop off here and take care of my baby. And I'll see you guys in another video. Bye guys.